Bioshock Infinite is a game rated M by the ESRB. Hello everyone and welcome back to more Steven Plays Bioshock Infinite. On the last episode, man, things are things are getting crazy. Things are, things have been really getting crazy, but we got Elizabeth by her side. She under It's just a lot of bloody footprints. She understands that we're not going to kill her. Um, and that we're here to help. And that even though it might be a little scary sometimes, she does have to trust us. Because uh, other people want to lock her up. And we don't want that. We're also looking for some lockpicks when we can. Bucking Bronco. Oh, it's a new, uh, new fun toy. New vigor. All right, yeah, sure. Drink it down. What is it? What's it do? Am I supposed to be a horse? Maybe. I don't know. What's it do? Press to launch your enemies into the air. Hold and release to create an eruptive trap. Cool. Right mouse button to launch enemies in the air. Hold and release to leave Bucking Bronco trap. And good God, get a lot of these. Dang, dang, dang. And when we strike, we will teach Cornelius Slate a lesson. <gasps> now, I know you've all come to think of Slate as some kind of war hero. But let me be abundantly clear. Cornelius Slate is no hero! Ah, he's been living down in Finkton so long that the man has gone native! <laughs> if Slate had his way, the damn colors and potato eaters would be up in Comstock House running Columbia! Or in your homes, copulating with your wives! Now, he has holed himself up in the Hall of sound. Heroes. And it is our job to get him out. Alive or dead. Once our gunships arrive, we're gonna storm hey. the hall. Who's Clear there? Him out and have you all home in time for supper. Hmm. Stop where you are. None of us. Oh, it's him. It's him. That was a pretty good, sh pretty good throw, I think. Careful. Let's try other uh, a fun new. Oh God, there's someone up there too. Oh, that really has a pretty short distance, doesn't it? Well, you gotta use it to learn. There's a lot more guys coming. So admittedly, the machine gun is good for clearing rooms in medium distances. It's not really a long range weapon. I can see why people would want to use the carbine. There's a turret, but I'm trying to, oh gosh darn it. I'm trying to figure out exactly where it is. Careful. Oh God! Shoot! Crows can be used on me also, and I don't like that at all. Oh, shoot. Oh, I really don't like that. The target is a mean. Oh, I guess that makes sense. Son of a pisser. You were low on salts. I'm aware. That freaked me out. I was like, oh no, my own crows have turned against me. And I was like, oh, those are just an enemy type. There has to be a tear around for me to use. I can't just pull them out of thin air. Good God. I really dislike that there are murder of crow enemy types. Oh, I really do not like that at all. Who is this fraud, this charlatan, this salesman of 
snake oil. What you saw today, brothers and sisters, was just the beginning. Zachary Comstock will hear our voice. His temple shall burn, and his idols of gold will melt and run in rivulets through the streets of Columbia. Goodness. Uh, yeah, let's give me some salts back. So that was a fight that, um, that happened. RPG ammo. Oh, snap. When's that coming? Mmm. I mean, I guess we had access to the, the heater early on. I'm getting a lot of RPG ammo. I can get a carbine here, which I might as well actually take instead of the machine gun for now. So I got ammo for it. Hey, look at this. Got a tip there were contraband guns hidden in the fellow traveler. Didn't find them, but funny thing, we found some old uniforms under the floorboards from the war. <laughs> Took guesses as to why they were there, but <laughs> who's there? You're slate, right, sir? Put the guns down! <laughs> Did you hear that, Comstock? That is the sound you have never heard. The sound of a soldier's end. Come to your hall of heroes. Prove me a liar. Yikes. Also, hidden guns? Supposedly hidden guns? What does that say? I can't read that. Hey! Look, a cipher. A secret message from the Vox Populi. Well, you're the junior codebreaker. What's it say? Don't know. But there should be a codebook somewhere. Optional. Find the cipher. Elizabeth can decrypt ciphers that hide secret Vox Populi compartments. That must be where the guns are. Find the cipher in its corresponding codebook. Okay, well, we'll tr certainly try. Um, every Everything that, like, you go out of your way to get seems very worthwhile in, um, you know, typical Bioshock fashion. It's kind of weird. A little strange. So, uh, we will definitely be doing that. We'll definitely be trying to find everything we can. Anything in the front here? Another lockpick. God, we have to get to five again? I need you to keep your eyes peeled in case there's, uh, some lockpicks that I just miss. It's over here. More money. This was this is where we came in. I now have enough uh, juice to actually do this. Pay me, baby. And you're just a normal dollar bill. How much? You can carry ten. Dang. Same for the barnstormer. I'm actually back up on my machine gun, but I kind of needed the carbine for this big area because everyone's so you far away. Thank you. Appreciate it. All right. Well, once we find uh, a code book, if we find a code book, we'll come back here. But the code book might be uh, might be elsewhere. But it looks like this is a pretty big area. We already took care of the guys, though, so we'll just have a moment to look around. Crap. I got plenty of RPG ammo whenever that comes up. That's exciting. So that's where I need to go, the Hall of Heroes. God, yeah, there was a lot of dead guys. I almost I was like, end that board, I need that board. Who's that? Slate? I actually know the fella. Seems he's still got a knack for making enemies. Booker already knows him. That's interesting. Well, it looks like we're going to be running into him again real soon. Nothing over here, so let's uh, let's try in here. Mm, it's quiet in here. Not like that. Well, I'm finding more cash. What you see there? A pistol. Okay. Uh, I'm good. But I appreciate it, thanks. What is that ticking? I 
just saw a lockpick. Did I imagine it? Did I get it? I don't think I got it. I don't know what that terrible sound is. There's gear in there, so we gotta we gotta find our way in there. Come on. I don't know if I grabbed the lockpick or if I imagined. I thought I saw it come up. Hopefully it didn't get glitched or something. <laughs> I'd be so upset. Shotgun ammo. This Box of almonds. Power. It's only fair they give me a cut of the profits, don't you think? Let's see which one are More you? Money. Catch, Mr. DeWitt. Appreciate it, especially yeah. because we're at a good place here. Pay me. And also. Oh my golly gee. Holy crap, man. Okay, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Which one's which? RPG clip size, machine gun, damage boost pistol, damage boost sniper rifle. We haven't seen that yet. Carbine, um, pistol, machine gun. Wait, is there nothing for my boy? Not a single one of these is for my shotgun. Are you serious? What? This or this seems good though. Reduces the machine gun weapon spread by 75%. Mm, that seems good. That seems real good. I think these were the ones we saw in the one before, so I guess they maybe never go away. Still don't have to have it, so I won't bother right the second. Thanks for the bonbons. I guess we can open this. It's locked. Come on. Give me something challenging. Got it. Let's see here. So what's in here? A banana. Sounds like something's gonna explode on me, but I guess not. I guess I'm okay. That's foolish. New boots, overkill. Killing with excessive damage stuns nearby enemies. And what's what of them wearing? Kill to live. Melee executions give health. Oh, I don't need that. So yeah, uh, overkill. Killing with excessive damage. That's just that's just fun conceptually. Let's do that. Let's always kill with excessive damage. I mean, if you're going, if you're gonna, if you're gonna kill, go big. Oh, I did not mean to eat those. I guess I got the lockpick. I guess I got the lockpick. I sure hope so. Also, there's the stupid clock. Alright. Just eat cotton candy out of a bin, if that's your thing. If that's more your speed. Alright, um... Let's go upstairs. Let's see what we got up there. We got overkill, uh, boots. That was something new and interesting. Oh, another lockpick. And money. And some other important things. Let's play this. God makes all kinds of soldiers, but he only made one Cornelius Slate. My father followed him up San Juan Hill, through the legations in Peking, and as he put it, through hell the order was given. At today's muster, Slate asked me if I was Sergeant Monroe's daughter. I said, yes, sir, I am. Slate said, your father always wanted a son. I hope the fool has wisdom enough to recognize his good fortune. This is just a way to get up here more easily, which is fine. There's not an easy way. I was going to say, is there another one? Should be another one. No damage from that. Okay. Um, and there was a safe back there that required three. But I I, I'm, I don't think we're going to wind up with eight lockpicks. I think we got what we got. And I never found any sort of code book. Unless it's like right here somewhere. Oh, I... Shut down gondola access to the Hall of Heroes. Must be because of what's going on with that man's sleep. Well, I suppose we can take those skylines above us. We just need to find a way to clear up that cargo first. 
Did I see this? I think I missed this. And maybe if we're taking the skyline, we can come back later after we get even more stuff. Who are the Vox Populi? That's a great question. Malcontents who loathe our way of custom. Who want what you have. Join the military. Fan. Hmm. Okay. I saw everything I needed to see in here, so I think we're good. I don't think there's any more things sticking around. Yeah, I, I don't know if they just give you the choice of, like, you have to open the safe or that door, and we chose the door. I don't know. But I guess if it'll allow us to come back, then we theoretically could if we wind up getting to five, uh, things. Not see anything over there. So we just have to, like, move this stuff, right? Shouldn't be that bad. This is going to be fantastic. You've never done this before. I think that keen eye of yours could find some ammunition lying around. I sure could use it when there's trouble. It'll take some scrounging, but I'll do my best. Wonderful. But really, just lockpicks. The more lockpicks you find, the better. The line's clear. Oh my god, I guess we're doing this. Uh... Alright, you ready? <laughs> Woo! Hold on a second. Okay, just checking. Seeing if it would let me land over here. And the answer is no. Okay. There's a very faint, like, ah, and it kind of sounds like the beginning of the Simpsons theme song. I've heard it for a while, but I thought maybe I was going crazy, but now I'm pretty sure I'm, I'm not. We have to do some jumping occasionally. This is our stop. Man, you're a natural. Is that fun? Did you enjoy that? Or was it not as fun as you thought it would be? I was expecting it to be more enjoyable. Good old pineapple. Alright, shock jockey. What's over here? Oh, that looks like a large gun. That's the RPG. Well, you know, they're giving it to me. So maybe, just maybe, I should be using it. That means that my weapons are a shotgun and an RPG, which, you know, is not a very well-rounded pair, admittedly. And I'm thinking, ugh, the pistol? I could actually shoot people when they're far away. But I just got this. Oh, but the shot, I love the shotgun. <laughs> Let's listen to this while I decide. Veterans! You shed your heart's blood for Colombia! Lost limb and viscera in the godless Orient! Comstock did nothing! And yet, look up! Whose image squats above you even now? At every angle and insult! If the prophet would make a painted whore of our past, what fresh rape does our future hold? Let us now make our stand and fill yonder hole with true heroes. Take this rifle. What rifle? Where? Where? Here, ammo. Well, okay. Guess I'm using. So I have a sniper rifle. Sometimes Elizabeth. A little late. She's been doing that for a while. I know you're up there. I don't know exactly, but I know you're up there. Let me go around to the other side. Well, I was trying to decide, and I guess I this was decided for me. I'm going to use the sniper rifle instead. Try to keep you stocked. Looks like we found where your old friend Slade is. Just find that shock jack and get the hell out of here. But who else is here? Sniper rifle ammo. All right, cool. 
Give me my crows. Hall of Whores. Oh God. Thanks. Oh my God. There's some sort of weird aim assist that I haven't noticed. Oh, I thought I had the shotgun. That was a big whoops. That was a big whoops. Switched over and I was like, I need to switch over the shotgun and blow this guy up. And I had the RPG. Holy Jesus. It would definitely be in my best interest to remember the guns that I'm using. Yeah, there's some sort of weird aim assist that doesn't seem to affect the other weapons. But definitely affects... This. I mean, it's kind of helpful, it's just... I have a mouse, I don't need the help, and then also it kind of trips me up a little bit. Is everyone dead? Sniper rifle is very good, uh, very good weapon. I hear them. Nope. Goodness gracious. Just go down like flies or crows or something. Are they gone? Was that it? This is a heck of a uh, heck of a combo to be holding on to the. Um, Sniper rifle and the RPG. Repair maintenance. And there's a lot of bodies to check. There's also like basically every gun I could ever want here. I'm down to. Well, I'm down one uh, one rocket on this, which is an oops, but you know it happens. Give me these. Thank you. Two thousand. Uh, ba 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 da ba ba da da ba ba. Scabba da dee. Scabba da doo. I'm fine. I don't spend money, money at the dollar yeah. bill. Okay, catch. Because I don't need to find finding rockets in a trash can. That doesn't make any sense. Whoever put a rocket in there, they probably need to get bent. Okay, I don't think missed anything down there. Yeah, there's some bodies. Well, former bodies over here. This is basically giving us access to every single weapon near nearabouts so so many all right but like i shouldn't um i should not take a sniper rifle in there that's ins oh hey look at this that's insane i should definitely pick up that shotgun that guy had which is definitely gone now. oh and there it is yeah cuz i'm going into close quarters if i if i take a sniper rifle I'm probably going to be in trouble Lord, here goes something. Machine gun. If I don't use the... I, like, I assume that they're giving me... Oh, a ration. I assume that they're giving me a, um... An RPG because I'm gonna have to, like, use it soon. Like, there's gonna be, like, a big battle with a big... Something. And that's why I'm like, oh, okay, I'm gonna need this. But if not, then I desperately need to get rid of the weapon because it's one of those hold on until you know, emergency weapons, and those are the worst kind. It's like when you hold all your Phoenix Downs until the last battle of the game. Does your life need a jolt? Try Fink Manufacturing Shock Jockey! Thanks, Mr. Fink! Finn. Huh. Well, this is where we're going to find it. Two doors. <sighs> Let's do it. Too rare is the man who takes a stand for God and sweetest fatherland. But here's the place where we revere the heroes of our city dear. Money, 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 money. Find Shock Jockey. Yeah, I'd say that getting rid of the sniper rifle is probably a pretty good call. Um, it was good out there. It's going to be far less helpful in here. Oh, that's good. Okay, so infinite salts. Ooh! First off, let's 
free because there's a salt machine behind me. And yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do it. Let's frickin' do it. Mini clusters for greater area of effect, range, and damage. Sold! So basically, this is powerful. Very powerful. Oh, and there's an armory over here. Oh, well, I might have spent my money just a second too soon, but it's fine. Sure, try and quickly find a little bit extra dough. Be right with you. Is there any money in here? Ooh, boxophone. They'll call us assassins when our work is done. Cornelius Slate, the swift left hook to the Vox Populi. <laughs> we'll be trading Comstock's lie for a new one. So be it. The Fitzroy woman and I are comrades of necessity. I doubt all the men who read in Caesar's toga would still be seen breaking bread together in peacetime. With Comstock gone, my men's past deeds will be sacred. And they will claim the spoils to them. I need not live to see it. It's kind of peaceful because, like, that all happened and I was shooting guys. It is what it is. Not sure exactly what they heard that, you know, that drew them to me, but... Uh, machine gun, carbine, RPG, sniper rifle, pistol, machine gun, RPG. When are they going to ever let me play with my shotgun? I keep getting my shotgun back, and they're like, well, you can't play with that. And I'm like, but why? And they're like, mm, we wouldn't like you to do that. Are you for serious? Uh... Yeah, I don't want to spend this on any of them, to be honest, because I just spent all my money on Vigor Upgrades, and I'm probably going to run into another Vigor Upgrade, and then I won't have enough money. I've been pretty happy with the guns. RPG Clip Size would be kind of nice, but that's so much money. I think I'll wait. Thank you so much for watching. Next time, we explore the Hall of Whores. I, I mean, uh, the Hall of Heroes. And we see exactly what it entails and how many shells we'll have to burrow into people's chests. Thanks for watching. See you next time for more Stephen Plays Bioshock Infinite.